Hello, Lola's. Welcome back to my channel. Guys, if you're not subscribed to this channel, please make sure that you give <laughs> that you do subscribe to this channel. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And look in the description bar for the links to the chatterbox and also um, my merch. So I am here with baby Noah and baby Nigel. Um, but I'm only going to be focusing on baby Noah. Um, he's just going to get, I'm just going to change him into this little outfit just to, it's pretty big, but I just wanted to put him on something warm because it's been pretty cool here. So I'm going to see how that goes. And, um, I hope everybody had a good weekend. Um, I know I had a busy but very productive weekend. I'm feeling pretty good about it. Um, the baby that I'm, well, one of the babies that I'm working on is getting very close to her final step. So hopefully I'll be able to have another baby soon. Um, of course, like I always say, one of my drawbacks is the fact that I do not root most of the time. I am rooting a baby myself right now, um, but it's a very slow pro process because I have other things that I'm doing as well in between. But um, that kind of slows me down because I am... I have to depend on other people's schedules and when I root, uh, send them off to the rooters. Um, but I love the rooters that I use and um, we usually work pretty well together. But that's why I don't do customs. Another reason why I don't do customs as well because I couldn't really give you a realistic time frame being that if you want the baby to have hair, um, I can't exactly determine, you know, exactly when the rooter will finish, exactly when I'll get into the rooter, etc., etc., like that. I try to keep a standing appointment with um, my rooters and the people that I use for painted hair so that um, I could just slide whatever baby is ready in. So I try to always book a spot ahead of time. Um, so I don't have, a, I don't be waiting too long, but sometimes it, it don't fall that way. So, and then I have my personal babies because um, at the end of the day, I really got into this um, painting and making the babies mainly was for myself and so because that's so I try to you know get the babies in and but then I, I keep pushing back my personal babies just so I can get the ones that actually that I'm selling to go in ahead of time if that made sense and that's why a lot of my personal collection babies don't have hair because they usually get bumped but the um, with India, I was like, you know what? I don't care. I'm I'm sending India, and I bumped her so many times, and then I was just like, nope, sending her, sending her, sending her this time. And um, even with me learning to root myself, I'll still end up needing to send the babies to the rooter because of how complex my schedule is. I just don't have the time so I knew this outfit would be kind of big it's actually three to six months um, I think it's Jamboree but I found that a lot of Jamboree stuff is cut kind of small but that's why it's baggy because I also put it on a really big baby too and it fit that baby so it just fits him differently but so, he's so cute in it. It's 
So yeah, so I hope, like I said, I hope you guys had a good weekend and I hope everything is going well. I hope to be able to hang out with you guys in the chat box tonight about 8 o'clock or so between 8 and 8.30. I'll send the link, you know, like I do a little ahead of schedule. Um, usually I try to do at least an hour ahead of time so that you guys can be prepared and get yourself together for it. Let's see if I can zoom in a little bit. But um, nevertheless, I hope you guys enjoyed just a quick change video. Um, that is baby Noah, for those that may be new. Um, Noah is the Willow Asleep by Claire Teller. He's actually the prototype number two, and he was poured, painted, and rooted and everything by Claire Teller. And Nigel, that's the sleeping baby over there that I haven't flipped over, he is actually the awake Willow. And also the same, but he is prototype number two of his edition, kit edition. Um, so I hope, again, I hope you guys enjoy the video and I will see you guys later. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and share it with all your dolly friends. See you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.